welcome back to my channel, Fashion Me KLV. I'm Kerry Lee Barley, and today I'm going to show you my little inner style haul. Um, if you've watched my previous videos, you will know that I am a huge fan of inner style, uh, particularly the uh, collaboration with Lorna Lux, and she has released another um, collection, which is their High Summer. So I've got some beautiful pieces from that collection. I'm really, really happy with them. So I'm just gonna show you what I've got. Um, and then I'll probably try and style up, up for you as I normally do and take some pictures just to show you what they look like on and possibly what I'd wear them with. Um, as you can tell, I've got a bit of a color scheme going on here. Some whites, some creams and beiges. And as you can tell from my house decor, that is kind of my go-to color palette. So I'm really, really pleased with these items. They're gorgeous colours and they're so versatile as well. So you can go with, you know, all sorts of things. So I'll style them up for you and uh, just give you some ideas, yeah. So the first item is from the uh, High Summer collection, which is this gorgeous little ruffle top. Um, it is called, sorry, I've had to write down the, um, the names and the prices just so I'll give you the right information, but where I can, I will link them down below. Um, this is the Say My Name Ruffle Top, um, £25, and it is such a cute little playful top. Um, ruffles on the front and back, uh, which I love because one of my biggest bugbears in fashion sometimes is when there's detailing on the front and then it's just plain on the back. It just looks like it's not been finished right, so I'm always very happy to see that there's detailing all the way around. So it's got um, like lovely little gathering detail at the top and these lovely straps which have got ruffles on as well. Um, and it's just kind of really easy wearing. It's versatile so you can kind of like pop in some high-waisted jeans, like tuck it in, a bit like probably these jeans actually. Um, on the, I think it was, on in Lorna's Instagram story, that was it. She was um, pictured wearing this tucked into a pair of high-waisted shorts from her collection as well. Didn't manage to get those because um, they didn't have my size, so I'm keeping an eye out to see if they come back in stock. But they that really look nice together, so that is a good idea what to wear that with. It's uh, took it into some high-waisted, um, like city shorts, or um, kind of maybe even going to go really well actually with this skirt here so I'm probably going to take some pictures um, of that as well. I think that's going to look really cute together, very ruffly and playful. So yeah, really really happy with that. It was really sweet and I think um, it was released in polka dot and black as well. So um, yeah, there are some other colourways if you like the style but uh, if you want something a bit darker. So this lovely skirt that I just mentioned um, this is called uh, She Won't Return My Calls, uh, it's £30 and I got this in a 10 and it just fits uh, perfect because I wanted to wear it a little bit lower down like on the hips. I think if you wanted it a bit um, higher then I think I would have gone for an 8 but I kind of wanted to sit a little bit lower so I've gone for a 10 and it's just comfortable and it sits right. It has got a zip fastening as well and it, the fabric is just so so nice. It's kind of like scrunched up chiffon. Um, it's 100% polyester and it's fully lined at the top half as well so you won't see your underwear through it. Um, the bottom has like, got a double, uh, the ruffle is doubled over and it's just so swishy. Like look at that swish, look at it go. So it's really really floaty and playful. Um, and again, one of my favourite colours, so it ticks a lot of boxes there. Um, I think I think they released this in black as well. Yes, yes they did, it came in black as well. So if you're thinking for a little skirt to see through the autumn or winter months, maybe with some tights or something like that, uh, this is going to be perfect. I think for the weather now, it's brightening up a little bit, but it's definitely coming on holiday with me later on in the year, because I think that's going to be just perfect. The next item is the Love Letters dress. Now this is the first uh, item that I actually put in my basket when the um, new collection was launched and I was really happy I was able to get it. It's just absolutely lovely, it's so feminine. Uh, the fabric is like an embroidery on glaze, let me see if I can show you that. Kind of like embroidered, it's fully lined. Uh, the sleeves aren't lined, uh, and so they're kind of a little bit more sheer than the body, but it's got Lorna's signature 
puff the sleeves so I just thought that is really really nice and feminine really good length as well I can't quite show you here how tall it does kind of comes um, sort of above the knee a little bit more a couple of inches above the knee so that's kind of a, a really good length I think not too short and not too long um, but look at this back detail I can't see if I put my hand down. There you go. So you've got a fastener at the back and then this like lovely detail in the middle which you can kind of ruch this um, tie here. So if you can just see that. So you can loosen it a little bit for a bit more coverage at the back or you can like really scrunch it in and tie it up. Um, elasticated bit here so it's really really comfortable really flattering as well it's a, it just kind of looks so sophisticated and, and feminine from the front and then it's like a bit of sass in the back so I'm absolutely loving that I got that in an eight and that just fits perfect very true to size and um, yeah just really really good quality um, that was 35 pounds um, so I think that is worth every penny of it. I'd say it's so well constructed. Um, you know, sometimes when you buy things and you've got you know, threads everywhere and it just looks cheap and tacky and not very well made, but this has been put together so, so well. So I, I'm really, really happy with that. They didn't uh, do this in any other colorways, so I'm hoping that they might be like a second release and that comes in another color because I think I'd really like that in maybe black would look quite nice or um, definitely some kind of like beige or tan colour I think that would look really nice in as well but um, I keep my fingers crossed that they may do another colour release in it but for now I think that's going to be lovely and um, maybe for a, a going out put some heels on with it and um, definitely coming on holiday with me as well that's coming in the suitcase so yeah really chuffed with that one now that was the high summer um, collection these were from her previous launches and this is kind of such an unusual top um, it is the madame royale top and it's got some really great detailing on this um, it's got a little ruching down the front as you can see there and it's got sort of a straight panel here which goes onto the sleeve and then ruching again at the back with it a zip fastening and it's tied at the back so you can kind of it has quite a lot of looks this top does and I've seen it quite a lot on um, Instagram people wearing it in different ways so you can undo this tie at the back and tie it quite far apart so it kind of drapes off the shoulders because you've still got the kind of tightness of the bodice but you can wear the sleeve which slouched down uh, you can like Boosh up the sleeves here a little bit and um, it's got this really long tie so you can tie it around the back into a big bow or you could just uh, wrap it around a few times or just around the front so there's like, quite a lot of different looks you can do with the top it looks great with jeans um, but also I think you could style it up a little bit with some um, like black uh, flat jeans or something like that with some heels to go out with or a nice skirt it's really 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 well made um, the bodice bit here is quite fitted and it's got this seaming down the front and it almost reminds me of like a, a corset kind of thing and it really does accentuate your waist and then you've got all this kind of um, big elaborate sort of poofiness at the top but yeah it's really really unusual I've not seen anything like that on the market so and that's what I like about Lorna's collection is because it's so different and uh, the prints are so different and um, the cut is so different I've not seen anything like this in the other stores so it is really really different um, and that's what I like when people comment on the tops and things that I bought from Lorna's collection like oh god I really really like that it's so unusual it's different and I think for me that's what I like to go for in fashion, something that catches somebody's eye that they haven't seen before and that's definitely uh, something that I've seen a lot with the Lawrence collection. It's very, very unique. Can I tell you how much that was? That was £30 um, and again I think because of the quality and the fabric um, I just think it was definitely worth it. Um, I'm really, really looking forward to wearing that quite a lot. And I think Again, if I remember rightly, this was released in quite a few other colours as well. So there's quite a lot of really nice prints, different fabrics as well. So if you were liking the style, 
um, definitely go in and have a look um, at the other colourways. Really, really interesting top. Really like it. So my last item, and I've been umming and ahhing about this one for a while. I think this was released um, now, quite early on in the year actually. And I was kind of kept looking at it and I love how it looked on people, but I just wasn't sure if I could pull it off. So I thought I'm going to give it a try. And it's actually, um, I kind of really fell in love with it when I tried it on. And it's unusual because it has this bodysuit attached to it, which actually comes in quite handy for if you wear it with some high waisted jeans, kind of ensures that it kind of gives that nice silhouette. Sometimes if you wear tops tucked into high waisted jeans, you kind of find it like working its way out throughout the day. But this is going to ensure that it keeps it tucked in nice and like nice silhouette around your waist. Beauty about this as well is it's thong backed, which I absolutely love in bodysuits. In fact, I bought the two color body, um, the two colors of bodysuits that were released in Lorda's first collection, um, the contour polo neck bodysuits, and they've got the thong back as well. So absolutely great for wearing with. If you're wearing with tighter trousers or jeans, definitely minimizes that old VPL, which no gal wants really. Um, yeah, really, really playful kind of flouncy, again, frilly flouncy top, and it is, yeah, super, super feminine as well. Um, I think that's going to look really nice with tucked into jeans. Um, I definitely think it'll look great with like a leopard print wrap skirt or something like that for a really feminine but nice going out look. I did get this in a six, and I think I possibly should have gone for an eight because the, the bottom half is a little bit tight um, but the top half fits exactly how I wanted to so it's like between a rock and a hard place of which way to go but actually I think it's going to be okay um, and again you've got these little buttons up as well little covered buttons uh, so you can actually unfasten it for a very very cleavagey look There you can see there, um, you can really, really fasten it so it's very, very low down, or you can fasten it right up to, just show you, it's hard to do this one handed. You can fasten it right up there, so if you're feeling a little bit conservative or you don't like to show a lot of cleavage off, you can fasten it quite high up, so yeah, it's, uh, it's quite versatile in that way. And uh, that was 32, and it's called the Fantine bodysuit, so if you're feeling that, I think these are still available on the website, so definitely go in and check that out. Um, I think they released that in black as well, so yeah, just a really cute, playful top. I think, I think that is so nice. I'm glad I decided to get that in the end. So that is the last item in my little haul. Um, I'm actually just going to mention my outfit today. Um, these are actually a steal from um, it's from a charity shop that's just opened up from where I live, which helps the um, air ambulance. So these were £3.50 and they're originally from River Island and I just thought they would hardly even been worn, so I was just really chuffed with that. Uh, me and my mum like to go on kind of treasure hunts in these places because you can find some really nice one-off um, pieces like mirrors and things like that. Um, house items and sometimes I've picked up some really great fashion items as well so yeah I'm really chipped with those. Um, this is an old uh, Zara knit top and I love this uh, it's just one of those really comfy kind of knitted cardigans I'm wearing it tucked in um, and it's just so soft and comfortable. Uh, my little necktie here is actually from uh, Lauren Lux's collection and I think it was um, it was like four pounds and it's actually the same fabric as the uh, Madame Royale top so I thought it's actually supposed to be a hair tie but I'm just wearing it as like a little neck band because uh, you know I don't know why I just thought it looked cool but um, anyway so that's my outfit for today and I'm going to uh, style these up for you show you what I would wear them with and um, show you what they look like on and again, I will try to link everything that I can below if you are really liking those and hopefully you can get some of them for yourself. Again, thanks guys for watching. It really means a lot. Um, I really hope you'll come back and see more of my videos soon. And yeah, watch the space and uh, have a great day, everybody. Bye.